Tommy and Nicole and Greg will be joining us in a minute. We're just waiting for him at the train station. Are all gonna go to someplace new today. I've actually never been there. It's an indoor theme park. So they have roller coasters and stuff all indoors, which makes it slightly less scary, which is good for people like me who hate roller coasters. <laughs> so we're gonna head there. It's called Joy Polis and it's in Odaiba. And if you can see behind me the Big Bang poster, this is actually what they're doing there. It's a Big Bang themed event going on now. They have roller coasters that play Big Bang music. They have like shows where they're playing the DVDs from the live shows. There's a themed cafe. A couple other things I'm not too sure of, but we're just gonna go there and check it out. A wild Greg appears. <laughs> Are you excited? Do you like roller coasters? Yes. Oh, you do? Yes, I love roller coasters. Do you, Nicole? Yeah, I love them. Oh, I'm the only one that hates them. <laughs> We're just waiting in line. There's quite a few people here. It's busy today. There are a few different admission choices. You can pay for just admission into the park for around $8, or you can get an all-you-can-ride pass like we did, which was just over 30. We got the night pass, which starts from 4 p.m., and the park closes at 10, so that gives you lots of time to ride a bunch. Give me a ticket for the UFO catcher. Oh wow, there's like a shop too. Selling some goods here. So cute. Cookies. Here you go. You needed a new bag. Oh, I kind of want this. It's cute. Look at the bag. Oh, that's really cute. Yeah. Nicole broke her bag today, so my bag is being held together by a safety pin. So this is the Big Bang roller coaster. There's currently a 30 minute wait, which isn't too bad. Apparently you can play a music rhythm game while you're on the coaster from your seat. I don't know, we'll have to see. We just got off the roller coaster. It was actually really fun. That's the funnest roller coaster I've ever been on. It wasn't amazingly terrifying. It's like a middle level of scary. And it went like at a speed that you can enjoy yourself where you're not like going so fast and you have no idea what's going on. And then at the first part of the roller coaster, there was like a rhythm game. So it just went like along the track like normal slowly and then you play, play a rhythm game along to Big Bang songs. It was really cool. I want to go on that one again. I think we'll probably go on again sometime tonight. I really want to go on the initial D one. You can pick a car and play the game. It's so cool. So if you don't have the passport like we do, you have to pay a price for each ride that you go on. They're all about 500 or 600 yen. I want to try this one. It's Joy Paulus Explorer and it's like this tunnel. I don't know. I don't know what it is. Let's go in. Okay, so we got a machine. Greg is our machine holder. And we need to walk around Joy Polis and look for symbols and like read them with the machine. And we gotta find five within 30 minutes. We're looking for a certain one. Apparently they're all different. And if you touch the wrong one, you lose five minutes. I bet this is it. This is, I think we found it, Greg. Touch it. Yay! What does it say? What does it say? Is it the right one? Oh no, it's the wrong one. There's another one right there. Oh no, wait, Shyla, up there, up there. There's one more up there. Oh no, this is our clue. Whoa. No square, yes, L, no other square. Smoking. Smoking area. This place is so big. This game is a good way to explore the place. I didn't realize there were three floors. So we're heading towards the smoking area. Go, Greg, go, go, go. Mm. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Woo, okay. 
next. This is our clue. What is some Wait. kind of game? It's one of those signs. But, uh, Dark Chapel. It's six o'clock now, so the Big Bang show is starting on the big screen. So we're on the third floor now, and these are all different simulators. We're trying to decide which one to do. This one's a jungle. There's a river at the end. Biohazard? Yes. Okay, Greg wants to do biohazard. <laughs> that was fun, it was like a little haunted house. And we had a tour guide and we were running from the zombies. <laughs> we're gonna try one of the simulation rides now. Maybe the jungle one? Let's try wild, wild jungle. So, we didn't make it through. Oh, here's the pools. Or this one? Wild River? We're gonna try Wild River. So you get in a boat like this, and then on the screen will be like a simulation. How was Wild River, Greg? It was fun! It, was, it was felt like a real roller coaster, yeah, right? It was. it was neat. They had a big screen in front of us, like a U-shaped screen, and then we sat in a boat and it like shaked as we moved through the video. It was really cool. It, it really did feel like a real roller coaster. Like, it I made me feel kind of sick. <laughs> it moved a lot. Like all the stuff fell out of my pocket. <laughs> Michael Jackson stood right here and signed this wall. Michael Jackson's probably been on that roller coaster. <laughs> I know. That's probably why he came. <laughs> and Leonardo DiCaprio. We're finishing off our day at Joyfulness. I hope you enjoyed that. I'll put the information for this place down below. If you're interested in coming here yourself, please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. I really appreciate it, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye!